Welcome back to the MS Project 2010 video tutorial series by group.net. In lesson 4.6, we see how to adjust working time for individual resources. So first, we see how to assign calendar to a resource, how to add holidays, and how to change the general availability of a resource. For this tutorial, you can use the sample project prepared at the end of lesson 4.5 available on group.net. Coming back to the project plan, we see that to the right side there is a column which is called base calendar. By default, standard is the set calendar for all the resources. If you want to change it, you can click on the arrow on the right side. It shows 24 hours, night shift, standard and any other project specific calendar that you would have made. So let us leave this at standard. Next we can see how we want to add holidays. Let us say for the resource concrete contractor, we want his base calendar to remain the same as standard but he is unavailable for certain duration. We want to set that in his standard calendar. So for that we double click and go to change working time. Here we go to the exceptions and we can type whatever kind of holiday he wants like let's say group holiday and set the starting time. Let's say he's unavailable from the 29th of April. And probably set this to 5th of May. And we can say OK. OK. So now the concrete contractor has been marked on a holiday for that particular time. This holiday has been set directly on the base calendar. However, this does not change the overall standard calendar. Similarly, let us say we want to change the availability of a certain kind of resource. For example, let us say the excavation equipment is only available on certain days. So we can double click the standard, go to change working time and go to work weeks and go to details. Let us say we want to say that the excavation equipment is not available on Thursdays, Fridays and Saturdays. So we can click Thursday, set it to non-working, Friday set it to non-working and Saturday and set it to non-working. OK. And again hit OK. So this automatically sets the excavation equipment resource calendar as non-working on those three days. So to summarize, we have seen how to assign a calendar to a resource, how to add holidays and how to change the general availability of a resource. A sample of the project plan completed up to this stage is available on group.net. Thank you for joining us on this tutorial. In the next part of the video tutorial series, we see how to document resources.